We can do something about this. It's not the first time they've marched on the Capitol steps. Mass shootings grip our news cycle. But this time they really want results. I think that the country is ready for it to be different. The proposals on the table are familiar. Demand background checks on all gun sales. And strong red flag laws. The DFL led House in Minnesota passed those measures this year, but Senate Republicans didn't allow a hearing on them. Do something now. Governor Tim Walz says now he may call a special session, but only if Senate Republicans agree to hearings and at least a vote. Let's have the vote on red flags and background checks, and with this pen, we'll sign it into law, and we can do it this week and finish that. Red flag laws to prevent people from getting guns if they're deemed a threat have passed in 17 states in D.C. and increasingly have gained some Republican support, though not enough in Minnesota. Republican State Senator Andrew Lang told me over the phone that red flag and background check laws are not a magic fix. He continued, mental health has to be included. He said, we need to find solutions that work. <laughs> But those who keep marching on the Capitol steps insist they've already offered them. And by this crowd, I know we will keep showing up. Thank you. The governor is the only person in the state with the authority to call a special session. And Governor Wallace said today that if he does, he'd like to tackle both gun legislation and insulin reform. But Governor Wall said again, he's not going to do that unless he can get a guarantee from Republicans that they'll bring the measures up for a vote. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Danny.